Hello everybody, this is Cheeseburger Jesus, and welcome to Hello Charlotte Episode 3, Childhood's End. And I know nothing about this. Ooh, Aetherworks, yeah. Aetherain presents. Come gather, both young and the old. Come and enjoy the show. A show of lies and gods, of twists and turns and imperfection, of sterile whiteness and ink-black vomit, blending into splendid gray, of paranoia and psychosis and the brilliance of a human mind. Welcome back, dear puppeteer. Long time no see. What are you here for, I wonder? The truth? Entertainment? Romance? <laughs> Don't tell me you're here because of our contract. If that is true, I will do anything in my power to help you save the child. In fact, I've already made my preparations for the journey. All you need to do is see it to is see it through from the beginning to the very end. Don't forget to save your puppet's data. Well then, I hope you'll enjoy the show. In the beginning, there was a voice. A voice I knew belonged to Mother. Be a good girl, okay, it said. Then suddenly, I knew what to do next. It's nice to meet you, I said. Please take care of me. Who was I meeting? Who was going to take care of me? Just who was I saying this to? I didn't know. I had no way of knowing. What was my purpose? Why was my head filled with memories of people I didn't know? Just what was I supposed to be? Be a good girl, okay, the voice repeated. A good girl. Is that what I was? You don't have to be, another voice interrupted. That moment I knew, before me stood the god of this world. Episode zero, and so it goes. Ooh. That dream again. What a way to start a new day. Oh well. I should greet everyone before going to school. When I mention titles, people think I'm smart. Yeah. Stay white with us, it reads. The aesthetic has changed. Aiden's room. I'm not gonna knock. Only white noise on this TV. Porter's happily reading the news in a loop. Modern take on All My Friends Are Dead is airing all day. All my friends are dead. I'm watching the TV now. We are not responsible for side effects, which inc include brain damage, internal ulcers, part full or partial body paralysis, hallucinations, and excessive set se sweat secretion. Um, this video is not sponsored. Let's keep watching the TV. Uh, it's the same exact thing again. We have the solution for you. I I would say no to say no to the the drug, especially when in the commercial that person's face is exploding. Uh, wait, can I? The buttons are broken. Yes, I, I hear the white noise. That's my room. What if I knock? Uh, 
Oh no. This one's smiling properly. <laughs> Morning. These dolls are so pretty. Where did you get the materials from, I wonder? Not telling, huh? Well then, I'll leave you to it. There's no use talking to you when you're like this, is there? Uh, that's the pick to pick whatever it was. Ugh. This one's wilting. Let's throw it away soon. Plants seem to be doing well. This one's doing better than the rest. A copy of the White Society pamphlet is lying on the table. All the books. If a book is colored differently from the others, it must be important. Oh, it's the same as the others. All the books have blank, blank pages. It's a carbon copy of another. I look pretty today. Covered in vomit. A toilet. Yeah, this is great. I'm gonna get myself killed. What am I supposed to be doing? A sink. An oven. Food in the fridge is symmetrically arranged. I should keep it that way. Knife lay is forgotten on the table. The camera is working properly. Oh wait, that's how I leave. Why does the house keep changing every single game? The boiler provides us with hot water. Boiler rooms are quite popular in horror games, aren't they? We have one too! Nothing of interest inside. I don't think I said hello to everyone yet. Okay. I'm just gonna save. Uh. Uh. Hi, Dr. Huxley. Hey, Dr. Huxley? Dr. Henry? Oh, gods, it's you, Miss Wiltshire. As you can see, I'm busy. I know, I just wanted to say hi. Sure, sure. Hello, good morning, how are you? The weather sure is fine today. With that done, I'll be returning to work. Here, have a pack of gummy ears and go make yourself useful to society. Yeah, whatever. To come to think of it, I've never seen the faces of the corpses you're performing the experiments on. Why is that, I wonder? He ignores me. Well, thanks for the input. Bye, Dr. Huxley. You know, she's really not a happy camper in this this game. Without the Isn't that what he said without the kind hearted Seth? So You'll be nice, right? Morning, Felix. Uh m morning. Been busy? Well, as usual. I've prepared the thing you asked me to here. So fast! You really are good at this. Right. This calls for a reward. Pet or flick forehead. Mm. I'm not gonna be mean. Winces upon touch, backing away. Something wrong? No, forget it. Weirdo? I was gonna pat you, didn't I? I feel something smack my head. It's a gloved hand. Morning, human maggot. Having fun? Yep. Bennett ruffles my hair with force. Mr. Monica here doesn't look like he's having fun, though. <laughs> or, is, or is it that he's just constantly bitter? Who can tell? I'm standing right here, you know. I know, I know. So, what are you guys up to? I just came for the bottle I asked Felix to prepare for me. Oh, what's inside? A secret cookie ingredient. Eh? <sighs> Tell me! Tell me now! Ask Felix. I should be going. Jeez, so mean. Oh, seriously, though, Charlotte just seems meaner in this game. Next room is locked. No entry allowed. Okay. No entry, especially for you, Wiltshire. Jeez. They're still so stuck up about that one incident. 
Uh, okay. Wait a minute. No, I was right. Okay. I'm going insane playing these games. It seems to be open. I can't wander around too much though. Enter. Yeah, let's die. No, let's not die actually. Initiating eye scan. Eye scan successful. Aren't you late for school? Nah. I'm just coming in time for lunch. Hey, I have something for you. I give the gummy ears to the elevator. Thank you so very much. Where do you want to go? To the second floor, please. Of course. Doom bum bum. The elevator music is really happy for the a bloodstained elevator. Like, I have a feeling it's drawn like this for a reason. I, I, I'm the Daily Wisdom Machine. Insert a coin to play. Feel free to send us your comments and suggestions. Please stop sending us the complaints about getting repeating messages. I'll burn your house down is not an acceptable complaint and it will be overlooked. The ones in power will always invent their parents. Is there a reason I... Isn't that C? Why can't I... Ooh, someone's having a hard time, but it's none of my business, is it? Oh, wait. Let me snap a photo. Good chink And done. Um, Charlotte. Charlotte. Charlotte, can we... Can we, can we please... Charlotte, don't do this. I really like the soundtrack, but but please. Okay. Stats, I don't know. Very smart. Just isn't really soft in the fall. Uh. Hello. I can't get him to understand me. Maybe you should try using Link. What's that? Well, it's a drug that connects minds. Neat, huh? How's your day? How's your day? Uh, I should not go in there. Firmer, I don't need to go there. The release of school garden. Gee, thanks. Loads. I don't know how I'm supposed to pronounce that. Oh, hi. I knew you'd come, so I bought us lunch. So how'd you like it? Lact or just how you like it? Like this free? Oh, how kind of you. Do you want to join me or what? If, if that's okay with you. Sure, I don't mind. Let's go to the rooftop. Our friends must be waiting, aren't they? Ah, will they be joining us today too? <laughs> of course they will. Food tastes better in company, doesn't it? Yeah, you're right. Uh. Ah. Uh. Good day, Miss Wiltshire. Good day. Oh, um. Yeah, Henry doesn't look that happy. <laughs> Hi there. G good day, Miss Wiltshire. Henry, say hi too. Uh, hello. Ooh, is that what I think it is? Miss Warhol is so considerate buying you a meal. Why didn't she buy some for us too? Uh, I... Uh, she didn't know you'd be joining in. Even though we eat together all the time? How rude. She won't forget next time. Right, Henry? Right. See? <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, where the click of the door lock. Wiltshire, 
skipping lessons again, huh? Oh no, it's her. Uh, the killjoy is here. Let me as always. Hey, let's be quick. You all know the rooftops off limits, right? It's not the first time I've caught you here. We're so sorry, Miss Class Rep. An apology won't cut it. We promise we won't do it again. Then get off the rooftop or I'm calling the teachers. Teachers, she says. Tell her, Lot Lotte. I don't know how I'm supposed to be saying that. Ah, let her be. It's more fun this way. Scarlet's expression softens a little when she hears, looks at Henry. Do you really need to be around them, Miss Warhol? You're better off without these low lives around. What are you talking about, Miss Eiler? They're my friends. As you say. Now then, leave immediately. I won't be repeating myself twice. Class right favors you, huh, Henry? Well, our little Miss Warhol here is famous for being the teacher's pet. Right, girl B? Yeah, right. Everyone's getting along. Thinking back, when did I meet Henry? Ah, oh, right. It was back then, when her skirt got stolen from her locker during PE class. By the girls right here, no less. She had nothing to change into, so she had to wear her track shorts all day. Everyone was laughing at her. Seeing how helpless and embarrassed she was, I felt a nothing, and didn't do anything. I left her alone, and now she's nothing more than an errand girl buying us coffee. That's all there is to it. What? Are you coming to class? Go on without me, alright? I have club activities today. Alright. Uh, what? I'm... <laughs> So I'm getting like, okay, even she's, what? Fancy meeting you here. There goes our profound bond. She just walked by. Um, do I know you? How cold. Nothing in the world can define me, but you can call me C. Ring a bell? Oh! Charles! Got yourself a new vessel? Wait, I've seen this one somewhere! Near the alleyway! Bingo. Picked it up on my way here. Now I can blend in with the rest of the students. Rather convenient, isn't it? Yeah, I guess so. You avoided the school grounds like the plague until today. <laughs> I suppose I really do feel more at ease in this vessel. Yeah, sure. But you're happy you got yourself a new meat suit. Is that how little you think of me? My only intention is to keep him safe. Right, right, you care. Sure thing. In any case, I have things to do. No time for idle talk. Well then, don't be late for class. No need, I'm skipping. You should join me on the White Society meeting next time. It'll be fun. I highly doubt it. But thank you for the invitation, nevertheless. You do you. See you later, C. So, I... I'm confused, so is... <laughs> am I going? Is this where I'm supposed to be going? Greetings, friends! Welcome to our weekly White Society meeting! What's our motto? Stay safe, stay clean, stay white. What's our goal? To ascend. That's the spirit. All worked hard and submitted new names to the blacklist this week. Well done. As you all know, the process of blacklisting is the following. Find the tainted, submit their information, vote. The person who gets the most votes gets punished. Easy as that. That being said, I want you all to decide on the special guest for today's execution hour. Vote. Vote for those who wronged you. Vote for those who upset you. Vote for those who hurt you. We shall hurt them a thousand times more. With this, the voting is over. Oh my lord. What?
Did you know that our bodies harbor 150 times more genetic material of micro... Um... Welcome to the execution hour. This program is supported by White Society. Hi everyone! Welcome to our daily program, the execution hour! Meet Girl B. For today's show only, she'll have the privilege of having a face! This is where I heard that song before- I've heard this song before. This is the context of the song. This, this is the context of the song. No. You must be wondering, who the hell is this? This is the first time I've ever seen this character. How the hell am I supposed to synthesize? And you're absolutely, totally right! Because this is a total stranger. But, if I told you she did bad things, you'd believe me, right? If I told you to avoid her, you'd believe me, right? Nobody cares enough to check the facts anyway. That's why we're here right now. Anyhow, she was chosen to be the guest in this week's episode by you, dear friends. Today we'll be baking cookies. Hush, we're on TV. Manners, remember? First you take a handful of butter and smash it into the bowl. Come on, put more force into it. Don't be a wimp. Then you put in a handful of flour. Ugh, come on. No, no, don't cry. Look, it's right before your eyes. Look, the flour. See, you did it. Here, I'll help you mix in the sugar. Keep mixing, keep mixing. You know, this pe person may look meek, but they actually support offensive behavior. Come on, show them the drawing. Here it is. No one in their right mind would draw that, right? Therefore, they must be punished. Really? That's why we'll add a special ingredient. I wonder what that is. Quiz time! Let's vote, everyone! What is the special ingredient? Needles, Clorox, or raisins? Dear God. What is wrong? Charlotte, no! Come back to me, Charlotte. We're gonna have some bleach brownies. Results time! Most of you guessed right. It was Clorox! <laughs> now we'll have our guests taste the cookie dough. Let me go! What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh gosh, mind your language! We're PG rated! We'll all pretend we didn't hear it, right friends? Our friend here seems to have trouble eating, so I shall pour the mess right into her mouth. Wow, sure looks tasty! Yum! Now then, we need, you need to preheat the oven to 180 degrees. But since we don't have an oven, we can use our guest's body as a substitute. Here I go! No. No. Oh no, this is what the comments were joking at. No. Dag nabbit. This concludes our show. Stay white with us. Join the white society. Destination reached. And this is when I start contemplating life. Country roads, take me home. 
I'm gonna save again before I go in and bug people. I'm too worn out to wander around. Dag nab it, Charlotte. You're never too wor uh, worn out to wander. Oh, I know. Let's watch more TV. Dag nab it, it's the exact same thing again. Why? Here, I'll mute myself and let you listen to the full volume at full black. enough of that. I, I, th thank you. Thank you. I could could have lived without that. Oh. I'm so used to that being the bedroom. I'm tired. Let's call it a day and get some rest. Good night, me. You did well today. Chapter 1 End. Welcome to the White Society. God of this world told me a story about a girl who was the heroine of the story of her story about a girl who was bestowed with a gift that could grant a single wish. However, were her wish to come true, she would die shortly after. It's the kind of gift it was. The girl wished for everyone to be happy. It was a kind, simple wish, full of hope. But all it did was destroy individuality itself, because she couldn't define the meaning of happiness. In another timeline, the girl wished for the world to end. It was a desperate, messy wish full of despair. But all it did was destroy only a fraction of the world, because she couldn't grasp how big it was. You, too, can get your wish granted, said the god of this world, because you, too, are the heroine of your story. So that's referring back to Hello Charlotte Episode 2's endings. There's school today, too, huh? I'm not in a hurry though, so I can wander around a bit. So that, um, that was two of the endings for Hello Charlotte Episode 2 that I was referring to. So now that I've thoroughly questioned myself and why I continue to play this ga <laughs> game, and it sends some chills down my spine, and me no longer l uh, have the same look for the song Swedish Fish. Anyways, this is uh, Cheeseburger Jesus signing out. I will see you in the next video, which I don't know. It hopefully will not be as, uh, what would be a good word for it? Mind boggling? No. I don't know. Dark. It probably won't be as dark of a video. Anyways, this is Cheeseburger Jesus signing out. Bye bye